Hello everybody, welcome to Young Flutes. Here's your first lesson on how to make a sound. Now, the basic breathing for shakuhachi is a meditative breathing, meditative breath. So basically you inhale up very naturally with a full lung into your chest, into your, the bottom of your throat, very gentle, no pushing, no struggle, all relaxed, shoulders, neck, everywhere. And just exhale, why don't you do that with me once? So we'll inhale. You can do this on your own for a minute and sort of feel out your breathing. And you probably notice that it's a five or six second exhalation. Now I want you to try this again, but exhaling through a Buddha smile with a tiny little opening of your embouchure, the shape of your lips right in the middle, and it's the beginning of the letter P. But never opening up. So try that again. Inhale and exhale through the Buddha smile. Inhale. Now that was about 15 seconds. You could probably do much longer. I know I could have gone on for 30 seconds. And that wasn't any effort in blowing or anything. It was just releasing the sound. So that's the kind of beginner's breath that you should use in playing the shakuhachi. Now I want you to put it on pause and uh, do, use your Buddha smile exhalation for a minute or two to get the feeling of that because we're going to bring it to the Utaguchi. Okay. So this is the Utaguchi, the song mouth in Japanese. Here's the back of the flute, and you want that to rest right below your lower lips. And this whole area from this corner of the Utaguchi to that corner is going to be covered with this area right there. This whole entire area is covered completely. So we're going to cover that, and I'm just going to hold it perpendicularly to line up the edge of the Utaguchi with my smile so there's no gap, no air whatsoever, like this. Now, if I blow my lower lips in the way, nothing's going to happen because this is completely sealed. But if I pull down a little bit and exhale with the Buddha's smile through there, I'll make a gentle sound. Now, the lower lip is underneath, and it's going to guide the air so that it comes out that way, not into the flute, but exhalation, hitting the back of the Utaguchi and bouncing across, creating the turbulence. So let's try that together. Inhale. So you noticed how I extend, my exhalation was long. It wasn't, which is the wrong way to play shakuhachi and it will cause hyperventilation. So you want to continue the exhalation, that feeling that you got earlier when you put it on pause and you develop that feeling of long exhalations. You bring that to playing every single time. So you want to get that while you hold your float, flute properly with the bottom middle finger between the bottom two holes top middle finger between the top two holes and the thumb just kind of floats and you rest it on your lower chin and when you smile you again you're lining up the utaguchi with where your lips meet and so you do this every time to learn proper placement proper holding and always relax your shoulders your neck you can sit you can kneel you can lay on your back whatever is most necessary uh, that provides a very comfortable Breathing, deep breathing into your lungs and long exhalations. Now, we're going to do this one last time, and you can always put this on pause and come back here. So hold the flute properly. Deep in inhalation. That's your first lesson today on how to get a sound. And when you're comfortable with the thumb hole open, you work your way down. And we'll cover that on the next lesson. Now, if you feel like you've learned something from this video and it's beneficial to you, 
feel free to make a donation to the Food Bank of New York City or your local food bank or to a civil rights organization that's been working towards equanimity and social rights, such as Asian American Legal Defense League, Southern Poverty Law Center, or Black Lives Matter. Thanks for watching.